Hey viewers, welcome to another game of the Casual Pro Gamer. Today we're doing planning, which is today's daily challenge from Blue Star Defense 5, and it is, well, it's it's a good one. So finally we have one that is actually a challenge, and we are going to start off with the Ninja Monkey, and we're, yeah, I kind of had to find a nice place for it, because it's only going to say 0, zero but we do need the, well, the power from it, so the, the popping power. And therefore, it has to be in a spot where, well, the ice tower is not going to be. I'm just spoiling you that there is going to be an ice tower. Only one. Uh, I think you should do it differently, though. But I'll, I'll talk about that later. First of all, we're going to do the two glue monkeys with an, uh, an ice tower. And then, well, the ninja monkey is just there. And the road items are going to be used to pop the moabs. So, um, well, the road spikes only. Um, yeah, that is going to be my setup. What I think should have worked easier is to have one um, ice tower and then, uh, oh sorry, one uh, glue monkey and then multiple ice towers. So I think if you build like three ice towers and then go for one uh, glue monkey that you will have a much, much easier time. But hey, this worked out, so um, yeah. It's, it's doable. The thing is that you will run out of money in uh, round 26. And that is the, the wave where you need the most money. Keep in mind that um, the, placing, uh, the placement of that ice tower is crucial. So place it so that the uh, range reaches about halfway on the left path. Just before halfway. And then, um, yeah, upgrade it. To one and zero obviously to increase the range and then you will get the most range out of that I could have done a little bit more to the right like half a monkey or so uh, but yeah I didn't want to risk it because well the first time playing I didn't want to risk uh, getting caught here and yeah this was kind of my first setup that I was going for so um, uh, indeed the title planning I planned ahead and um, kind of thought of this and this might actually have worked so um, yeah it does it does work in the end but it is going to be super duper close and you will see that in wave 26 because well all of these waves are just to gather up some money and then wave 26 will have four moabs in it and yeah that is going to be sucky as hell should have placed some uh, road spikes about 10 on the road before that first moab but um, yeah I didn't so there's that and yeah I'm just going to spam some spikes on the bigger balloons uh, preferably the ones with glue on them uh, because well if you pop the big balloons with um, with glue on them they will split into smaller ones and the smaller ones will actually then be taken out with the glue uh, so it's a uh, it's kind of a, a good thing to have and this, of course, is not a, a, a difficult wave. With one ice tower, you should be able to manage. And I'm not even going to use road spikes on any of this anymore. Because only the first few got through. So, um, yeah, relatively easy, but a very nice challenge this time. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. GG.